Ladies and gentlemen, Geekish here again, back with a view, and today, we're gonna be taking a look at the Bluedio F2, or Faith 2. I just got them from the mail yesterday, and it's time to unbox this puppy up. Alright, so, I'm just gonna be doing a voiceover because I wasn't so satisfied with the audio that came out of the iPhone. But, um, yeah, so pretty much, as you can see, the box here is enclosed in this bubble wrap protective, um, I don't know what to call it, shell maybe? And the box of the Bluetooth headphones themselves are inside. Let me just slide that out. Right, so after that, you're going to be uh, greeted with this beautiful box from Bluteo. And at the front, it shows you the Bluteo uh, Faith 2s, um, Bluteo branding and whatnot. At the back, it shows you the technology they use, some features, and of course, the diagram, where the buttons are, what they do, etc, etc. So you then slide out the sheath that comes with it. And uh, you know, pretty basic sheath, um, has a pull tab on it, and then you're greeted with another solid box from Bluedio. It has the Bluedio branding embossed into the box, and the box does feel very, very premium. Right, so you're then greeted with this flip tab on the box, which is held in by magnets, and once you open that, you see the contents of the box. There's not too much to it, but um, you know, it gets the job done. And um, on the left hand side here, you should be able to flip open this envelope tab thing. And it contains your manual, which is written in different languages, in including English and Chinese. Now the main piece for the puzzle here, guys, um, is the headphones themselves enclosed in this hard case, which, you know, protects them during shipping. And of course, if it can protect it from shipping, then it can protect you from shipping it everywhere, like your school, your work, whatever. But, um, yeah, the hard case, it really isn't that hard, nor is it soft. Um, I would like it to be a little bit harder, but, you know, it gets the job done. And um, it actually looks very nice. It's accented in this red zipper. And uh, it comes with a carabiner. It's included. You know, that's very great for, you know, trying to secure it to your bag, or maybe you'd want to hang it down your pants. I don't know why you do that, but, you know. So opening it up, the zipper is very smooth, and it doesn't get snagged on its way out. And once you flip that... Ladies and gentlemen, you're greeted with the headphones themselves, a small pouch containing your um, few cables, which I will show you later. Now, let's focus our attention to the headphones themselves. It does, you know, like any other product, it's gonna be protected out of the box, it has this, um, you know, plastic coating. Time for some peel therapy. And then it's on to that small pouch at the beginning of the box opening. And uh, it does contain your cables, that includes a USB to USB-C and USB-C to 3.5 jack if you want to run it in wired mode, and yes, you can run this in wired mode. So what is my stand on the Bluteos F2? Now, the only thing I can say is for the price, they are absolutely great. For the price you're paying, it doesn't get any better than this. A supreme build with a premium quality and premium feel at a price that everybody could be happy about. Now on to the pros and cons of the product in which I can think of at the top of my head. Now number one pro is the soft leather ear cups or leatherette because they are very soft and you could wear this thing for hours at a time. Next up is the headbands themselves. Maybe it's made of aluminum or some kind of metal and um, this will last you quite a while. Then comes the battery life of the Bluetio F2. I've charged this once a week and it hasn't died in me since, and I've had this thing for almost two weeks now. Not to mention that the ear cups do swivel 180 degrees outwards, which becomes a gripe of mine actually. And of course, the biggest pro, and I think the last one at the top of my head, would be sound quality. Supreme sound quality at a very low price. I can dub this as the Beats Killer. Now come to the cons. The only gripes I had with these are, number one, this faith branding on top. Now some of you might like this feature, but it really isn't for me. And the last con I could think of was the swivel ear cups. They do swivel outwards, but they never swivel inwards. Now this causes some issues with comfort, then again you can still wear this for an extended amount of time. If that greater to done pressure in the front of your ears do not bother you at all. Now I thank you all for watching this unboxing and review of the Bluetio F2 wireless Bluetooth headphones. And if you ask me, would I recommend them? Absolutely. Now go and get these pair in the link in the description via Amazon and Lazada. So, um, you know, you have a few options there. And I'd like you to support the channel by rating the video, commenting thoughts, and subscribing to my channel. So that my friends would think I'm cool.
Just kidding. But anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. Hopefully my video has improved since the last one. And I'll see you in the next one.